No fucking way. Dante and Randall slapped you with a restraining order? Ain't that about a bitch? So you're gonna abide by the court's ruling, or are you gonna go bandit, Reynolds style? Judge said if we go within 100 feet of the stores, we get thrown in the county. You know what they make you do in county? Toss the salad. I guess if you guys really wanted to hang out in front of a convenience store, you could just buy your own now. What, with all that money you guys made? Hell yeah, bitch. Wait a sec, what money? The money from the Blunt Man and Chronic movie? Oh my god, don't tell me you have no idea there's a movie being made of the comic you two were the basis for. What? Since when? Here's the pulse, all right? And this is your finger. Far from the pulse, jam straight up your ass. Say, would you like a chocolate-covered pretzel? You see, kids, if you read Wizard, you'd know that it's the top story this month. Check it out. When the fuck did this happen? Well, after X-Men hit at the box office, all the studios started buying up every comic property they could get their dirty little hands on. Miramax, option blunt man and chronic. Miramax? I thought they only made classy pictures like the piano or the crying game. Yeah, well, once they made She's All That, everything went to hell. So you're saying you haven't gotten a monetary cut of the movie? Didn't Holden McNeil and Banky Edwards used to pay you likeness rights for the comic book? We haven't seen a fucking dime for no movie. Well, boys, I'm no lawyer, but I think Holden and Banky owe you some of that proverbial fat cash. If I was you guys, I would find Holden McNeil and ask for my movie check. Shit, yeah, we got to get paid! And on that note, we cue the music. Matt, Matt, Matt! Matt, Matt, Matt! Matt, Matt, Matt. Matt, Matt, meow. Wow. Look at these morose motherfuckers right here. Smells like somebody shit in their cereal. Bong. <laughs> that was good. Come on in. So, what brings you two dirt merchants to my neck of the woods? Oh, I'll tell you what our necks are doing in your woods. Where's our motherfucking movie check? You heard about that, huh? I got nothing to do with it. That's Banky's deal. He owns the property now. I sold my half of the blunt man and chronic rights to him years ago. Why the fuck would you do a thing like that? Why in God's name would I want to keep writing about characters whose central preoccupation is weed and dick and fart jokes? I mean, you gotta grow, man. Did you ever want anything more for yourself? I know this poor hapless son of a bitch does. I look into his sorry doe eyes and I just, I see a man crying out. He's crying out, when, Lord? When the fuck can your servant ditch this foul-mouthed little chucklehead to whom I am a constant victim of his folly, so much so that it prevents me from ever getting to kiss a girl? Fuck, when, Lord, when? When's gonna be my time? He knows. I'm the chucklehead. You're the fucking dumbass who gave your comic away. Now you don't get no fucking movie check, neither. Well, when you're right, you're right. I wish I held onto a little piece of that thing, because the buzz is any indicator. That movie's going to make some huge bank. What buzz? The internet buzz. What the fuck is the internet? The internet is a communications tool used the world over where people can come together to bitch about movies and share pornography with one another. Here's what we're looking for, moviepoopshoot.com. Poop shoot. Yeah. This is a site populated by militant movie buffs. Sad, pathetic little bastards living in their parents' basement, downloading scripts and what they think is inside information about movies and actors they claim to despise yet can't stop discussing. Okay, this is about Blunt Man and Chronic right here. Inside sources tell me Miramax is starting production this Friday on their adaptation of underground comic fave Blunt Man and Chronic. Friday? Shit, does it say who's fucking playing us in the movie? No, but it's Miramax, so I'm sure it'll be Ben Affleck and Matt Damon. You know, they put them in a bunch of movies. Who? You know, those kids from uh, Good Will Hunting. You mean that fucking movie with Mork from Ork in it? Yeah, I wasn't a big fan either. But Affleck was the bomb in Phantoms. Word, bitch. Phantoms like a mall fucker. What's up now? Uh, all right. Uh, so here we go. Now this is the shoot back section. This is where the people who read the news get to chime in with their two cents. For example, we got a guy here with the chick magnet net handle Wampa One opining on what he thinks about Blunt Man and Chronic. He says, Blunt Man and Chronic and their stupid alter egos Jay and Silent Bob only work in small doses, if at all. They don't deserve their own movie. He's got a point. Fuck him. What's the next one say? This is entitled, Fuck Them Up Their Stupid Asses. Blunt Man and Chronic is the worst comic I ever read. 
Jay and Silent Bob are stupid characters, a couple of stoners who spout dumbass catchphrases like a third-rate Cheech and Chong or Bill and Ted. Fuck Jay and Silent Bob. Fuck them up their stupid asses. Who the fuck said that shit? Uh, he calls himself Magnolia Fan. All right, here, check this one out. Jay and Silent Bob are one-note jokes that only stoners laugh at. They're fucking clown shoes. If they were real, I'd beat the shit out of them for being so stupid. I, for one, will be boycotting this movie. Who's with me? Then there's like uh, 50 more posts of people who are joining Spartacus here's boycott. I'm gonna kill all these fucks. Let it go, man. They're not talking about you guys. They're talking about Blunt Man and Chronic. They said Jay and Silent Bob. They used our real names. Doesn't matter if it's, there's a comic book version of us and a real version, because no one knows we're real in real life. Really? And all these people reading that shit think the real Jay and Silent Bob are a couple of jerk offs because all these dickheads are writing about the comic book Jay and Silent Bob. You know, maybe one night me and Lunchbox are out, we're macking some chick and shit, and she's like, ooh, I want to suck those guys' dicks off. And she's like, what's your names? And I'm like, Jane Silent Bob, recognize. And she's like, oh, I read on the internet that fucking, these guys were a couple of little fucking jerk offs. And then she goes and sucks two other guys' dicks off instead. Well, fuck that. We gotta put a stop to these fucking hateful sons of bitches before they ruin our good names. First of all, I don't know how good your names are. Second of all, there's not much you can do about stopping this pile. The internet has given everyone in America a voice, and evidently everyone in America has chosen to use that voice to bitch about movies. As long as there's a blunt man in chronic movie, the net nerds are gonna have something negative to say about it. But wait a second, if there wasn't a blunt man in chronic movie, then those fuckers wouldn't be saying shit about Jay and Silent Bob, right? They're not saying anything about you now, okay? They're talking about fictional characters. Fictional characters. Am I, am I getting through to you at all? So all we gotta do is go stop the fucking movie from getting made. Yeah, and forego the hundreds of thousands of dollars that you two would be entitled to in the process. What are you, fucking retarded? I don't think I'm alone in the world and uh, imagining this flick may be the worst idea since Greedo shooting first. You know, a Jay and Silent Bob movie? Who would pay to see that? But... Since it appears inevitable, I recommend that you guys go hunt Banky down and get your motherfucking movie check. As you so succinctly put it, because that's what's important, right? Um, no, Holden McNeil. The important thing here is a fucking bunch of motherfuckers we don't even know calling us assholes on the internet to teenagers and guys who can't even get laid. Putting a stop to that is the most important thing we could ever do. So when's this movie getting made? Uh, they start this Friday. So if today's Tuesday, that gives us... Eight days. Uh, three by my count, but close. Right. My bad. Three days to stop that fucking stupid movie from getting made. Come on, Silent Bob. We're going to Hollywood.